cutting down of trees has become the biggest contributor to preservation of this landscape, followed by agricultural activities that are unsustainable and have led to these communities being poorer than they were. Coupled with the impact of climate change in Pale, it has become warmer by each passing day, with the erratic rains which come once in a cycle of five years. Now when rain sets in, it's basically flooding. After this flooding, another five years of drought and famine. The water resources have dried up in the past 10 months. The rivers have dried up, the wells are for dark. This means that agricultural activities are highly affected. Communities have to now go to the forest and uh, cut trees to sell firewood, timber, poles. It's an economic activity to help them you know, sustain their daily activities. Our approach is to work towards tree growing in order to restore degraded lands as well as boost uh, agricultural production uh, both in communal and private lands. We are conducting activities like composting, soil and water conservation and also agroforestry and also tree growing where we buy tree seedlings to farmers uh, basically non-fruit and fruit tree seedlings and also soil erosion control measures. Our target is to undertake tree growing and uh, provide farmers with incentives in order to enhance livelihood which were affected as a result of deforestation and climate change impact. Uh, we therefore ask everyone to join us in Kuala and enhance and help us enhance their livelihood resilience in quality.